Hey Club Mad Geeks, I'm in the bottom of an ice crevice in the Viedma Glacier and it's amazing to abseil down here. As I've come down, I've noticed that the colour of the ice has changed. As I go further down into this crevice, the ice becomes a deeper colour of blue. Now the reason that the ice is a blue colour is because water is actually blue. Anything has colour because when white light shines on it, if it's a coloured object, certain colours of the spectrum are absorbed. Remember, white light contains red, orange, yellow, green, blue, violet. So if an object appears red, that means that all of the other colours of light are absorbed except for red, and the red light is either transmitted through the material or reflected off the material. So when we look at the ice in this glacier, it's a blue colour, and the reason for that is the light that shines through the glacier, some of it's being absorbed. In fact, it's more of the red end of the spectrum that's being absorbed, meaning the blue light continues to travel through the glacier to our eyes, so we see a blue colour. So you might be wondering, why doesn't water in your cup look blue? Well, the reason is, you look at a glass of water, it appears colourless or clear, and the reason is that the light only has a short distance to travel through the water. But when light travels a long way through water, like the ice in this glacier, it begins to appear blue, because those red colours are absorbed significantly enough to give us a really clear blue colour when we see it. So water is actually blue.